everybody! I'm here in Rancho Palos Verdes at Jen Irwin's house. She was the contest winner from last month for the hashtag Megan Fabulous Dress. I'm so excited to be here. We're gonna give her styling, we're gonna have her try on some new dresses and have a really good time. Come on everybody, let's go and say hi. This is Jen Irwin. She's hi. an amazing author who won my contest last month. She took an amazing photo. So excited to be styling her today and giving her oh, some I'm new so dresses. Excited. Come in. All right, let's go. So Jen, you have some really fun pieces. <laughs> Thank you. You do! Like, look how cute this little dress is. I mean, there's so many different ways that you could wear this. I worry that I'm getting too old to wear this kind of dress. Style does not have age. <laughs> Seriously, like, right. you could be wearing something that you think is not age appropriate, but it's all about how you hold yourself and mm -hmm. your confidence. Going in the back of my closet and digging out old things I haven't worn and going, hmm, how can I wear this in a different way that you would never think That's of? That's so awesome. I yeah. Love it. You're so saving Charlie money right now. <laughs> right. He's going to be so happy. So Jen, I think you have impeccable style. You're classic you. and you have your own look, which works for you. I think if there's any kind of style advice I could give to you would be if you're doing anything related to your book, which mm -hmm. is called Address the Color of the Sky. Mm -hmm. Wear a dress the color of the sky. Yeah, I love that idea. I told I I need a, I don't have a dress the color of the sky. I totally need that. You're gonna walk in the room and everyone's jaw is gonna be like, <laughs> who is this amazing <laughs> author? So this is my jewelry drawer and it is kind of a mess, but um, way more organized. I just have piles. Like I have literally like a pile, pile, pile. I, I, I never really know what to wear with this. What are you um, talking about? This. <laughs> it's so perfect. Like you can take the pendant off and repurpose this and wear it, and then maybe even put something else on it that you would never know yeah, that you would right. wear. No, but Just with fashion, it. there's no rules. Yeah. I inherited these rings from my mom. Um, I never really know what to do with them. Oh my god, I want this for myself. <laughs> this is amazing. Again, there's no rules. Stack more is more, mm -hmm. and I think you know. I think when people start to follow the rules, that's yeah. when you're not expressing mm -hmm. yourself. Let's get ready for this fabulous fashion. Jen, this is your color. This is spectacular. I you. love it, Megan. Oh I my God. Women just want to feel beautiful. Mm -hmm. They want to walk in the room like you just did yeah. and wow everybody and like jaw dropping. We hand make all of our jewelry and so we oh, make these, these earrings. earrings. And they've got so these really beautiful. cool AB crystals and tassels which are a huge trend. I mean, I'm all about the big earring. I think it draws attention to your face and it accentuates your features. Like it's like popping out of your hair. This is such a fun dress, I love it. This is what you're gonna wear when you have to go to a business meeting, yet fabulous, sexy, sexy business meeting. Mm -hmm. She's got this conservative Megan lock, but then she has her playful fun and the bling bling money in a awesome. thing. I'm a fashion fairy godmother. Like, so, you know, you probably don't think it, but you can really wear a print. A lot of people think when they put on print, they look like wallpaper. And you don't. And don't be afraid I of don't print. I love how it has the slit. Yeah. yeah, so you're like super fun. Boom, super walk in the sexy. room. Boom, yeah. walk in the room. When you open up your closet, you need to look inside and go, oh my God, that's my favorite dress. It's like mm -hmm. candy. You're such an accomplished author, and I'm so, like, I was just so stoked that you won. Oh, you know, not you. only are you a friend of mine, but you're also so close. So giving the opportunity oh. to do the styling event with you. I was so stoked. Oh my God. <laughs> but, so tell me a little bit about your inspiration um, for Address the Color of the Sky. Well, I created this character um, who is going through a journey. Um, she's checking into rehab, but at the same time it goes back and forth in time. So you see what brought her to that place. Wow. She's a sex addict. Um, but she's a very likable. I mean, who isn't right? a sex addict? But I mean, <laughs> she, I get it. She's a likable and sort of call it "Girl Interrupted" meets "Orange Is the New Black." I mean, you're just but, such an inspiration, oh, and thank you, you for writing me. for women and you know touching on subjects that not a lot of women talk about. Uh, thank you. For, I'm glad I got chose. I got my name pulled out of the jar. I was like, "Wow, yes. you're in the score." Cheers! So fun. What a great day.